Hey everyone. Now hopefully, I won't be too drowned out by uh, the cicadas. But take a look at the mailbox. Redid everything there. Turned out pretty good. Uh, made a lot of improvements. Made a lot of progress on the house. Uh, mostly on the inside. But uh, check out the uh, hibiscus here. Loving that spot right there. Uh, bought a few things. Oh, some lights. Uh, oh, got a pedestal sink from the uh, at a yard sale. Uh, Fifteen bucks. Uh, looks great. And I already had a plumber come out and redo uh, the sink. So, got a uh, stove. I was going to keep the new, the old one, but it works fine. It just shows a lot of wear. Um, it's stuff that just can't be cleaned up. Check out the old... Uh, Picked this up at a uh, uh, flea market. I'm going to clean it up, uh, put it down in the basement. Um, uh, it is heavy. Somebody spent a lot of money on this to get it framed. Uh, handmade by James M. Collins, winter 1937-1938. Um, I guess it's a scarf, but somebody really thought enough of it to get it to get it framed. That had to be. I wouldn't even try to guess at how much that that would cost to uh, to get that frame like that. But it was very expensive. Countertops are coming this week, Wednesday. Thought they were coming last week, uh, but I had the date wrong. Wrong Wednesday. So. Wednesday, we get the new countertops, new sink, new faucet. Going to get garbage disposal put in there. Uh, we'll get the uh, um, get the stove in there. It's in really good shape. Check it out. Uh, anybody in the Baltimore area, you got to check out this place called Second Chance. It's in Baltimore City. Uh, they got some really cool stuff in there at, at amazing prices. Uh, this stove, we got it. You can see how they mark it down after every certain day. So we got this stove for $201.50. It's got a couple scuffs here. Inside is great. Get some uh, white enamel touch up paint for a couple scuffs here. I'm going to save that one. We're going to put it down in storage because uh, it's a Gen Air and pretty expensive. Uh, but uh, so next week this time this place will be looking really good. Uh, let's see. The uh, bathroom. We have a working working sink. Had to uh, go to the internet to get this uh, wall mount uh, faucets. That's working pretty good. Uh, the mid-century modern room. I don't think I've made too much um, changes in here since the last video. Uh, living room. Uh, no change here. A lot of change, I think you'll notice, when we go upstairs. So take a look at the uh, red, white, and blue room. Uh, ceiling fans are up. I don't know if they were up before. But uh, the window's been replaced, well, fixed. We have uh, one, two, three, four uh, twin beds. 
Uh, that's what they're pretty much going to look like uh, when they when we get them all uh, fixed up. Got to find a couple end tables. The uh, touched all the glue up and uh, redid all the red. Had to tape up and uh, repaint all the red stripes. Touched up the white. Went through uh, three rolls of uh, frog tape taping everything up but it was worth it uh, nice uh, nice crisp lines you can see um, so this is going to be a great room when uh, it's almost done we'll get the beds uh, beds made oh check out this chair I picked up at the flea market for uh, five bucks is that a cool stool or what uh, let's go over here. Bathroom. Not too much to do in the bathroom. Maybe change out that uh, um, door handle. And I think we'll put some uh, some baskets in here for uh, filling full of towels, bedding. Um, uh, this is what we just picked up today. Nice antique. Uh, king bed. This came from. Turn off the air here. This came from uh, Second Chance. Got the foot for it and all. It's in a really good shape. Well, a few scuffs and everything on it, but uh, there's the uh, the boards. But. Uh, be a nice looking piece. We're going for a uh, Hollywood Regency uh, feel in this room. I think this bed is going to be perfect. Uh, you can see the original price on this bed was $1,198 when they first brought it in back in October. Then it went down to $958. Then it went down to $778. Then it went down to $599. And then uh, the lady gave me another 10% off um, today. So I got it for uh, $550, $540. Um, but a uh, cool piece. Needs a little bit of a uh, touch up here and there. But uh, love the bed. And uh, we're going to build the rest of the room around the bed. And it's going to be going to look amazing for the uh, Airbnb photos. Oh, check out the mirror. Two dollars. That's a two dollar mirror. Bevel glass. Nice quality uh, mirror. Can't go wrong. And I don't know if I showed you these before. These, uh, these are hospital beds. Mattresses. Got the uh, flea market. Uh, these are the uh, for twin. Uh, Got four of them. The guy gave me a price of uh, thirty-two, thirty-two dollars. If he had them on for ten, I got them for thirty-two since I was taking four. Uh, so we're getting there. A whole lot more to do. Oh, I love the curtains too. Um, so. Probably concentrate on this room next. Get that bed together. Um, get some rugs up here on the floor. Then start moving furniture in. Uh, called out the uh, the cleaners. Had the whole place cleaned. Um, and actually had to call them out call them back because um, it was just they missed a lot especially down here um, but there's basement that spot is just screaming for a pool table uh, missed missed a nice one at second chance uh, somebody had already bought it but uh, I'm gonna start going back here uh, so the basement's going to stay unfinished for now. Love these lights. They're uh, LED 
and just light everything up like crazy. This is going to be a uh, storage area uh, for uh, for everything. Uh, but we're getting there. Uh, you know, this was a uh, the cicadas are uh, really loud today. Um, so we picked up this uh, patio table for uh, uh, 149. So uh, I don't know if we're going to keep it here. Probably uh, move it back. Uh, I think we have a little bit too many patio tables on the patio. Uh, so we'll move a couple of these out of here. So uh, uh, we're getting there. Uh, July 1st is coming quick, but, uh, um, pretty happy with the progress this week. Glad to get that red, white, and blue room almost done. And, uh, hopefully by next week I'll, uh, be able to show you a whole lot more progress. So, uh, we're getting there. So until next time, this is a. Uh, I'm getting ready to say, "Will the yard sale survivors?" But uh, oh, did I show you the uh, window boxes? I got the. Uh, check out the window boxes. We. Uh, I made the brackets up uh, myself to fit on the uh, on the brick, and uh, we painted the window boxes uh, the same color as the uh, the mailbox post and the uh, um, the front door. So it's looking good. And so, till next time, uh, we'll uh, talk again soon.